Hello, I'm Stuart Little, General Secretary of the PSA and Branch Secretary of the CPSU New South Wales Branch. Here with me is Ian Weldon, our Aboriginal Liaison Officer, and we're here to talk about NAIDOC. The trade union movement and Aboriginal people share a unique and twined history. Indeed, back in 1946, it was Aboriginal pastoral workers that walked off the job in the Pilbara to mark the longest strike in Australian history. National Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander Week begins in 2018 on the 8th of uh, July. And um, the theme for this year is Because of Her We Can. But I just wanted to, to make people aware of... Um, this year also marks the 80th anniversary of our first protest march where Aboriginal people stood side by side with our unions way back then, and it's 80 years ago to um, fight for our rights and justice in our own country. And, of course, we've, we're now in 2018 and at this point in time we still celebrate um, our, the richness of our culture and we still stand beside our brothers and sisters within our union movement. And I've got to say that my first um, protest march actually be, was in 1972 mm -hmm. and um, we marched from the streets of Redfern down to Town Hall and beside us were, of course, uh, you know, some pretty powerful union, uh, like the, the, the Builders Labourers Union, the Wharfies, and, and, of course, all of the university students that joined us as well. So we've, we're still fighting um, as, as I speak, but what we do in this particular week is that we want to celebrate, and we do celebrate the richness of our culture and our heritage, and more importantly, we want all Australians to celebrate and share our culture, you know, and understand the richness that we have um, as Australians together. So, um, and the theme I think is is one that reflects the matriarchs in our community. And I'm I'm talking about the matriarchs, the unsung heroes mm. that that laid down the foundation, you know, 230 years ago, 100 years ago and indeed even 50 years ago, um, where they, they certainly were the teachers and the matriarchs, the leaders in our communities that allowed us, um, you know, to go forward. And, and uh, the theme, I think, is very, it's a wonderful theme, um, you know, that, that certainly gives height to the importance of Aboriginal women and indeed women in our, in our society. Within Wiradjuri culture, one of the, one of the, the essence and the, 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 the essence of, of what our culture is all about is about leaving legacies, not about building empires. And that's what those incredible ladies instilled in us. And, um, you know, they were our teachers um, and certainly guided us through life. And I'm forever grateful to, for what they've done for me because if I think I had it bad and then when I reflect back on what my mother um, endured, I could not imagine how hard it was for them. I really cannot. And and then you go back another generation and indeed it was harder again. And that same yeah. thing would apply to a lot of a lot of a lot of people, a lot of a lot of Australians, you know. Mm. And they've laid down that foundation for us all. So, you know, um, that's what it's about, it's about celebrating the strength of women in our community. PSA is so fortunate to have someone with Anne's experience throughout the public sector, indeed Anne's connections in local land council and the community uh, builds such a strong relationship between the PSA and frontline Aboriginal workers. We're very, very fortunate to have Anne working on our Aboriginal employment strategy and indeed Anne and uh, Mal Cochran before Anne helped set up the Aboriginal council uh, and indeed what was the forerunner to our inaugural Aboriginal conference. NAIDOC week starts this Sunday, the 8th of July. Please check the PSA website for details. Thank you.